Hello everyone. This is a little western diamondback rattlesnake, Cretalis atrox. We are on a piece of land in Texas that we're doing a little work on. We're running an environmental site assessment for the property owner. And a lot of a lot of cover on this place. I'm I'm not surprised that we've uh, found a snake. Kind of actually surprised we we haven't seen more of them. It seems like the weather is really good for snake activity. It's real bright and sunny out here. And uh, this this county generally is. Um, it's kind of known as a fairly decent hot spot for these guys, a few other species. A lot of times before I go do a job in, a, in an area, I kind of like to dig up and see what all has been found in that area before. And see if I can target anything while I'm down there or when I'm, when I'm off or after hours and sometimes you just come across something on on the job site which is uh, what's happened today it's really really awesome this is not your normal looking western diamondback rattlesnake this particular one looks like he or she I think it's female I could be wrong but he or she um, either, I think, has parasites or is dehydrated or is just not having a good, good month, week, whatever. Normally, you, um, you don't see um, kind of the ridges and things. And, th and this guy is awful, awful thin. This guy's maybe a foot and a half, two foot long. It's not a big one at all. If he if he looks big on the screen, believe me, that is optical illusion. This this one is not a big rattlesnake. I would say about two foot, right at two foot. And um, don't know if uh, he's gonna make it throughout the summer or not. But uh, this, this is a western diamondback rattlesnake. They are found in this area. They, um, they can eat amazing amounts of rodents. I was talking to someone the other day and they gave me the analogy that, you know, like, you know, imagine a rattlesnake eating, you know, 18 to 20 mice per year. Let's say half those mice are female and then go on to reproduce litters of four to six, three to four times a year. Okay, if they take out 10 mice, they may have at a minimum taken out, you know, 40. So, good reason to have these guys around. Um, they save farmers' grains. They prevent electrical fires. Leave me a comment below. Uh, not the best video I've ever made, but um, thank you for watching. Please hit subscribe.